just made it to ozone getting mask on so i won't have hands to put it on when i get in there see it's like stretched out i need to get another one of these masks kyle brought me today let's do this and hopefully it goes well it's a chilly day finished ozone the lady who can do my veins I don't think will be here Tuesday so I think I'll just have to end up taking time off but honestly that's okay and she told me fatigue is so normal she's like do you feel better I was like I feel tons of fatigue and she said oh yeah she goes I get that she goes some people really do and then she said that I might I should start feeling better at some point though but for now I have the fatigue She said I might just be very valvey. Because when you're on a valve, it like vibrates when she pulls it out. And it did that a lot. But I don't know if you guys be able to tell. But I have a pretty large <laughs> bump there. I was like, why does my arm hurt? You guys can't tell from this angle, but it's like I have a little, like a golf ball. Right? right you can't tell. There. Because of that one blowing and kind of infiltrating. Because <laughs> it blew. And I think we, we, she said probably some blood, but I think we filled it with saline a little bit too. <laughs> That's huge. And then here's the arm we actually did it on. Now we're gonna head home. Okay, I didn't show you guys making this because I just got out of the bath and I need to go lay down. But I'm making some of the avocado pudding I've not made for a while. Avocados, cocoa powder, stevia drops. They're really good and tasty. Morning. It's been a while since I've just started a vlog. Actually, in the morning, real life, still being in bed because I'm sore before work. Um, but today is Tuesday. It's the week of Thanksgiving. Hope you guys had a wonderful Thanksgiving and were able to. Um, enjoy it whether you're by yourself or if you're with family if you're feeling well if you're not I hope you were able to find the joy in the day I did wake up to some pretty harsh comments on YouTube so it was a little bit of a struggle but shaking that off just want to um, quickly remind you guys any social media vlogging Instagram it's a highlight reel you only see especially for me because I am so sick you only see a fraction, like I might vlog 15 minutes in one week and then an hour in the next week, that month. You see such tiny amounts because that's all I can do because of my health, because I'm too sick the other times to pick up the camera. So just a reminder to be kind. I'm not gonna get into all that right now, but I just wanted to say a huge thank you to all of you that do support and are so kind. Uh, putting myself out there, especially sick, is very hard. And editing for hours upon hours when I'm in a lot of pain, which is every time I edit is hard. And I get a message of someone sharing something and I'm like, this is why I do this and this is why I need to keep doing it and I feel called. So again, I just wanna thank you guys so much for supporting my channel and being kind and um, spreading love instead of hate. I appreciate that. Some better uh, updates. The past like three, four, five weeks, I have been, the fatigue was like so bad. I was on like full herbs, full peptides, full ozone. And you guys obviously don't see this, but I mean, everyone around me could see this. I was it was awful like I lowered my herbs significantly um, the past week and I feel like I can semi function again to my sick way of functioning I'm grateful for and I'm trying to just really believe that ozone and peptides will help and I can lower the herbs and let this do its thing versus just treat so much that I get so sick so it's a hard balance but um, so I'm excited. Hopefully I can actually vlog a little bit more, just my daily things. It being Thanksgiving week, I don't have work Wednesday, so I also plan on vlogging a little bit more because I won't have to be up for work. I go to dance this morning, but I don't have much to get ready because I just put on a mask and put on my workout clothes 
and uh, it doesn't take long at all. We are still trying to figure out our Thanksgiving plans. This year I decided not to do any traveling. Last year I'll link those vlogs down below. It's a lot of fun but very very hard and with how I've been feeling there's no way I fill up, fill up to it. It was a very hard decision. He's staying home. Uh, Kyle hasn't decided if he's gonna go yet. My parents will be here so I'll see them to I'll be home to rest. Um, I was planning on getting ozone this week but I think I've told you guys only one nurse is able to get my veins and I've had a lot of trouble um, not their fault I it's just how it is but on my last ozone um, this one blew and then it infiltrated with so that's been since Thursday today's Tuesday I'm still on a pain over there and then I was gonna get ozone this today actually um, and she told me she wasn't gonna be there I have marks all over my arms now and lots of scar tissue and then this one's still really bumped up from Thursday so I, I just took that as a sign not to get it this week even though I've been trying I have been getting it every week and hope to eventually try twice a week it should be a good couple of days I hope to make a I looked up uh, easy pie recipes just looking them up made me feel so sick and tired so I did that a couple days ago and I think I found the one I'm gonna do so I'm gonna make that either probably tomorrow yeah Wednesday so I invite you guys to come hang out with us this week between the sickness and treating and detoxing and the stuff that you don't see but looking forward to hanging out with you guys all right I have to go to work in about 45 minutes so I'm going to, my arm's really hurting, so I'm going to rest a little bit and then we'll get ready to go. All right, I just read some Bible time, getting my slippers. I got really nauseous, but I'm um, gonna ask Kyle to make me, I call them mold pills, but they're um, my binder. And then I'm gonna charge my, my camera and I'm gonna get on the couch for about 30 minutes uh, before I head to work. Good morning, Bert. Whoop. Love you. I have some, some very sweet cards this year. Thank you so much to everyone that's watching this that sent me um, cards for my birthday. That was very, very kind. My in-laws bought me these beautiful flowers. I always come out and uh, turn on my tree first thing to enjoy. And we have a uh, dehumidifier in our crawl space, so it's very dry as we want it to be. And then we also use a dehumidifier up here. But where I'm specifically at, I need to have uh, kind of like a bigger diffuser going um, because my eyes get really dry. But I this when I wake up too. Hi, good morning. Just want snacks all morning. I'm already starting to feel pretty sick and then when I get home from dance I'm really tired and I'm gonna try to walk today right when I get home while the sun is heating up I get my herbs ready to go first okay just made it to work I'm having a very hard time opening my eyes they're wanting to close really bad I had to turn the heat off because the heat was making me way too tired so now I'm just trying to muster up the energy to make my eyes open and uh, be okay for the next 30 minutes. Oh, it's really hard to not want to close my eyes and my neck to fall. But I, I made my electrolyte drink and everything and I left it at home so that's not helpful. Very cold in here, so I got my mask on right away. I'm cleaning my other mask. So I'm gonna wait to put my hair in the bun and let it be down and keep my neck warm, keep my coat on, and hopefully it'll warm up before the kiddos come. All right, just finished up my class. Went small today because of the holiday, so that's kind of nice. Let's go home, take herbs, hopefully get a walk in before the sauna. Fading pretty fast, so. I think I need to um, lay down a little bit, which you guys won't see, and then I'll go ahead and do my walk in herbs. 